Let's look at the difference between first person and third person when it comes to video games. First person perspective is viewing the game as if you were inside the game. You only see what is directly in front of you. Basically, you are the character and seeing everything from their viewpoint. Third person perspective allows the player to see the entirety of the environment. They can see what is happening with the surroundings, opponents, teammates, and themselves from a view up behind their head. We ask why first person in some games and why third person in others? Well, every game designer is different, but based on the type of game, you may want to use a first person perspective for things like FPS, first person shooters, or even use first person when it comes to driving a car inside of the car. When other games are third person, so you can see the character as they run or as they drive or as they jump from behind them. Some games change during the gameplay automatically. They'll go from third person to first person based on something you click or press, or maybe there are different scenes that automatically change what you see and where you see it from. Some games allow you to scroll with the scroll wheel on your mouse or select different settings to move from third person to first person and back. A common term in first person shooters is the term ADS, aim down sights, which takes you from a third person view looking down the sights of your barrel. And when we think about those games that are first person or third person, playing them in a different perspective can be quite tricky. For example, we're going to put the settings on Rocket League all the way up so we can see a wide view in third person. As you can see, you can see the entire environment all around you, and it makes it easier to find the ball, other players, and the goal. Now let's switch the settings to make it more of a first person view all the way into the car almost. As you can see, trying to find the ball and turn can be pretty difficult. This is why some games really aren't best if you do it in first person. Plus, it kind of makes you dizzy and nauseous. So thanks for learning more about the differences between first person and third person in video games.